I'm Tavana Betts. I work with Sunrise Health, HCA. We are a healthcare system here in the Valley with four hospitals and 16 urgent care centers. My um, role is Director of Tourism and Emergency Services, do marketing and outreach. moms asked me to create a marketing piece for her real estate company. They ended up sending it over to their graphic design team and turned it into a mailer. So just being 10 years old and getting a postcard of something you created in the mail was, I mean, out of this world. Um, I knew after that, I mean, in high school, I created an ad for Albertsons and ended up winning a contest. I've always done PR marketing. I've done marketing in-house in many different industries, but it's been my passion, so I've ended up loving every job I've had, specifically healthcare. The campaign we're working on right now, actually, it's called Down in Vegas. Since I do tours and marketing outreach, we created um, a campaign where Tourists can come, look at a website, get more information than just healthcare. Uh, it's great because it pops, it's a pop art theme. We've driven a lot of traffic that way. We've got billboards out there, we're in taxi cabs, things like that. It's, it's really exciting because we developed it from scratch and it's unlike anything you've ever seen in you know, the healthcare marketing space. I've been marketing for about 15 years and most of it was in California. So 28 years of my life I was in California doing marketing and outreach. Here, it's very different. I hate to use the T word, which is a transient town, but you really have to incorporate that into all of your marketing strategies. Um, there's just a dynamic duality in trying to reach you know, the local market as well as the visitor market and trying to cross those barriers and you're almost competing against yourself sometimes and it's like your coach and you know, you're coaching for the home team and you know, the visiting team and pinning them against each other is never the goal, but they're very different strategies in how you're gonna approach you know, the outreach. Find a way to win. <laughs> so typically, I don't know, I just feel like you can't make excuses, you know, and there's always going to be hurdles and, and, I don't know, a lot of obstacles to get around, but there have been people who are wildly successful who have done it at a much higher level and been able to make it and succeed. Um, in marketing, it's always, I don't know, have an empathetic approach to your strategy because you have to remember you're not your target audience, and a lot of people forget that. I think it's a great fit. We get a lot of tourists that come into town. A lot of them get injured. It's not just dehydration. It's not just you know alcohol poisoning. It has a lot to do with you know an ankle. People fall off curbs, and you know people get lacerations, things like that. And so we offer you know locations that are really really close to the strip and are able to accommodate you know everyone who comes in. that we're entering into the space where now proteins are coming, we're getting a lot of interest in outside, you know, Vegas casinos, um, hotels, we've got a lot of other things going for us. Even with the park, I mean some of the theaters, Smith Center's kind of ramping up their stuff. Um, we just have a lot more to offer with the snow. I think that more people are going up there, ATVing, there's so many other things going on and I think people are starting to finally take notice of that and kind of come together as more of a community. I love the arts and being creative and media, so bringing all of that together, I'd love to be a writer and a producer for maybe commercials or TV shows or something where I can just utilize all of my experience and it's kind of like a baby and watch it grow and, and I'd love to be a part of that on the other side of the camera. <laughs>